work at ESRI is done by development teams who are really passionate about what they do. They really care about the problems that they're solving and it's the result of that focus that users see in these amazing capabilities that emerge in the products. We want to make solutions uh, and the best way to do it is creating digital twins of a city. Now with the technology that we currently have, it makes it so much easier to make better decisions. Now planners can um, directly create grids for their land use or for the study area. It can be a TOD, it can be the entire city or entire county. We are excited to present a new organization homepage. This is mobile ready, responsive. It allows you to create experiences for both your visitors to your organization as well as your members. We added SQL capabilities such as the creation of views in file view databases. This allows the user to construct different views of the same underlying data. Attribute rules really help users streamline their editing experience by helping them automatically calculate values throughout tables and layers and preventing them from inadvertently adding invalid data. So what we want to do is to, to help improve insights in these missions, provide better situational awareness. A mission analyst can quickly go back in time and identify certain information of importance to help make fast and quicker decisions. You can create, manage, and configure webhooks to automatically send you notification when events associated with your portal items occur. On the charting, we have improved the timelines. You can have multiple timelines on one chart. We can do clustering. We can do kernel density, density ratio. For the first time, deep learning has made artificial intelligence at par or even better than humans at things like classifying images, detecting objects, or understanding speech and language. A really cool thing about ArcGIS Earth is that you can edit KMLs, and you could edit and draw directly on a building footprint. Once you're done that, you can extrude that data and have it appear in 3D. Now it's really easy to add labels to clusters. So say you only want to show the labels if it has more than 10 features within the cluster, you can do that. We'll give you that full control. You don't need to write in code. You don't need to understand the software. You don't need to understand the program language. We're trying to hide the complexity of the technology and provide the greater usability. If you're a fan of the mobile app, uh, we have made many exciting enhancements, like the survey notifications. We can connect your survey and the data that you collect with hundreds of apps and services that you already use in your organizations. With ArcGIS Story Maps, you can create a guided tour. So a guided tour is a great way to bring people along with you and your story to different places around the world. Our focus in this release was really to make ArcGIS Pro work better for you by adding missing functionality like map graphics, by improving performance in many areas, including enterprise databases, and by making you work more productively. What's unique about ArcGIS Enterprise for Kubernetes is that every piece of functionality is designed as a microservice, which means they can be orchestrated all in one in a Kubernetes fabric, and this fabric can run anywhere that you choose. We're horizontal in nature with all these industries. And just the change that we affect on our daily lives in the world today is what Esri is all about.